R is the rest. One of my favourite words. Rest is so important in everything in life, when you're exercising and when you're doing yoga. If you're in a yoga class and you need to rest, we need to take it. So often you might hear, particularly me as an instructor, but others say, if you're in a place and dog and you need to take a rest, come down to child's place. We're still active, we're still being part of the practice, but we are listening to our bodies. If you're in a balance and you need to rest the legs, bring it in. Nothing makes me happier than seeing somebody come out of a posture for a little rest because their body is telling them they need it. How can you bring this into real life as well, not just in the classroom? Rest is not a dirty word. It really isn't a dirty word. Rest can bring you the most productivity that you have ever done. Just taking a step back from that project, from that work that you've got going on, and even from family and friends, and just resting can give you a whole new perspective. And if you are a woman, if you have a cyclic nature, then rest is doubly important. At particular points in our cycle, our bodies literally order us to sit the hell down and rest. And if we do not listen to it, if we take that very, very masculine route that we're going to power through, power through, power through, then our bodies will not build as they need to, muscle isn't built properly, our brains will be foggy, and we just won't be living our best lives. So rest when you need to. If you are struggling in a posture and the teacher is begging you to rest, listen, please, please listen. Enjoy the rest. <laughs>